Okay, guys, thank you for tuning in to episode one, Small Boat Shorts. This episode is going to be about my floor system inside my John Boat to Bass Boat conversion to Top Gun John Boat. Um, guys, what I've done already is I've removed my side panels, which are these panels. Okay, these panels go here and here. Okay. I've, re I've removed my panel that goes over here for all my wiring and I've removed underneath it um, this stow compartment that goes over there. So I've got everything gutted out. Um, I'm doing final wiring, so it's a good time to go ahead and do this. Never did a video on floors, so here we go. Quick walkthrough. With this, you just simply get underneath it, lift up. And this is 11 32nd plywood that's coated in a layer of fiberglass resin and then painted in oil based paint. And over here, what we've got is I've cut to fit um, some Artec foam. And what I've done here is I've doubled up half inch. Okay. I don't know if you could see that, but this is just flush with my rib okay so what I've done is I've doubled this foam up and I've gorilla glued it together with a gorilla construction adhesive it's cut to fit okay it simply goes in into place this goes over it and then the panels lock into place and hold everything down. Okay, I've moved my wiring out of the way to show you that the back is very similar to the front. One thing I did back here was I actually used some uh, Gorilla tape, uh, similar to duct tape, to tape some foam pieces together while the glue set up, just to hold them in place temporarily. Little tip. So these are all glued, double foam. And back here, the lighting is better. You can really see how this sits me dead flush with my rib. So this floor system is just sitting on top of this. The foam adds buoyancy, okay? It also adds insulation. It also reduces vibration and noise inside the boat. And then also acts as a riser or spacer to support my 11 32nd plywood okay <clears throat> that is my floor system so it doesn't crack or sink or bow when i walk across any of this it actually feels very very good and again 11 32nd plywood for my for my floor system is what i use to uh, ultimately save weight within the boat now here you'll notice the sheen this is all coated in fiberglass resin. And what I opted to do back here was just leave it unpainted. Um, after painting the front section, I realized there's no need to paint this because it's sealed in resin and you're never going to see it. So no need to paint. Um, but that is it, guys, with the floor system. I'd love to do a more in-depth video at some point on a future build. But I figured for episode one of the Small Boat Short Series, this would give you a little bit of insight of what is actually under my floor and how is it how it's in place. Again, it's a floating floor system. Nothing is bolted into any ribs. There are no screws in this floor system. It it simply sits in the boat. So it's very key for all the measurements to be dead on as far as where these notches are. Everything is set very nice and flush. Everything to plane out and be leveled as far as your insulation and how it's raised off the ribs. And then up front, these panels actually lock in and bolt in and hold the floor down. Back here, the same deal. There's a side stow compartment here and a side tray compartment here that's going to house my electronics. And those things hold the floor system down back here. Thank you guys for watching episode one of Small Boat Shorts where we like our boats tiny and our videos short.